Now we got to get to the controversy over video from the January 6th attack on the U.S. Capitol never made public before. It was reportedly turned over to Fox News by the new Speaker of the House, and critics are raising security and ethical concerns about it. ABC's, ABC's that is, Andrew Dimbert reports. This morning, Fox News host Tucker Carlson says he's been given access to more than 40,000 hours of unreleased surveillance footage from the January 6th attack. They have not released any of it um, from January 6th. And January 6th, of course, is a transformative event in this country. It's been used to change the country. It's unclear where Carlson's team was reviewing the footage or who they got it from. But according to multiple reports, House Speaker Kevin McCarthy granted Tucker's team access to the video. McCarthy's office did not respond to an ABC News request for comment. Carlson has repeatedly spread conspiracy theories about January 6th, saying this on the one-year anniversary. Looking back, you could probably call what happened on January 6th a riot. We have called it that. But really only just a riot. Maybe just barely. Congressman Jamie Raskin, who sat on the January 6th committee, branded the release of the January 6th footage an ethical collapse, tweeting, what security precautions were taken to keep this from becoming a roadmap for 2024 insurrection? Carlson has already claimed that some of the new footage appears to show contradictions. Some of our smartest producers have been there uh, looking at this stuff and trying to figure out what it means and how it contradicts or not the story that we've been told for more than two years. We think already that in some ways it does contradict that story. This controversy comes just days after a court filing revealed private messages from Fox News personalities, including Carlson, showing they doubted allegations of voter fraud after the 2020 election, even while publicly pushing the false narrative. Andrew Dimbert, ABC News, New York.